Got one, got one, got one. Oh, got something. Oh, you it's got still it. on? Got something. Oh, you got it. A bass. Guys, welcome back. Today we are doing our favorite type of fishing. We're going to go pan fishing for some bluegill. Maybe there's some crappie in this uh, golf course pond we got going on over here. And there's a creek behind it, so who knows what we're going to catch. But we're going to have a little uh, tournament, husband versus wife. What do you think? Uh, biggest pan fish or you want to do numbers? Let's do numbers, but I think you get like two extra points. For yeah, bonus biggest. points for biggest fish is, uh, yeah, I think that's fair. You excited to get back to our roots of fishing, creek fishing, pan fish, all that? It's been way too long. I'm yeah. super excited. Catching big bass in Florida is always fun, but catching giant bluegill should be even more fun. So let's uh, head out to the water. There should be some, uh, I think they're bedding. The last time we were here, they were guarding something. So uh, we're going to uh, see what's under this bridge, see if we can't catch us some big bluegill, some big crappie. Should be fun. All right, we got the GoPro strapped on. We're starting off with this here from Big Bite Baits. It says it's just a pan fish lure, but if you ask me, it's like a little tiny crawdad. So let's see if the uh, the fish are biting it. Oh, that is a giant, giant. He came right out from underneath there. He heard something hit the water and then he went and fought off some fish back there. Let's see if we can't get him to bite though. What are you throwing? I got micro jig. Uh, yeah, I think your line is much heavier. Yours is that cast king line they were using last time. Mine's whatever came on this uh, 13 fishing code white ultralight combo. I think it came with line. I don't remember what the uh, what it was though. Yeah, I'm definitely not breaking off with this line. <laughs> yeah, you ain't gonna break off. I think the state record in Florida bluegill is 2.95 pounds. Well, I know it is because I looked it up, but uh, I don't know if that's gonna break off, Ashley. Got something. Oh, you it's got still it. on? Yeah, it's still on. What is it? Oh, it's a bluegill. <laughs> oh no, it's a tiny little bass. <laughs> That's the size of bluegill we're going after, but Ashley caught one on a little micro jig. All right, Ashley is on the board with her first fish. He uh, gave himself a little early release, but I think you had like what the, uh... oh, you got a trailer on there? Yeah, yeah show them what you're. Uh... The jig with. I'm not really sure what yeah, it's trailer, a little, it's kind of nice little paddle tail, tail swim bait I think trailer. I really did it. Yup. Brought the girl to the party. Oh, and right in the schmutz. Right in the schmutz. Ashley's going in for a rescue mission. I'm sorry, dude. You got him? Landed. Landed, it counts. <laughs> All right, buddy. Nice. All right, Ashley is up two to nothing. I've been sitting here messing around with this tiny little swim bait and my fat fingers can't get it uh, tied on, but- uh, Two bass, not what we're going for, but still a fish. Yeah, I wouldn't complain about it any other day, so. <laughs> All right, see if I can't get on the board after trying to tie this on for an hour. Oh, got one. <laughs> Even smaller. Let's see if he stays on, yep. All right, fish number one for me. Ashley is uh, killing me right now, so <laughs> gotta get back out there as quick as we can. Whoop. Right there, perfect nose dive. That's how you wanna get him back in there. <laughs> All right, a little bit of a slow start today. We're kind of shifting gears. The uh, bluegill were not... Uh, they weren't having it. Yeah, they weren't uh, very friendly today, but I think Ashley's in the lead. She's got two bass. Mm -hmm. We should turn this into a who can catch the smallest fish thing. Yeah, I think it's just small fish. Yeah, small fish is the... Uh, the uh, theme of the day but let's see if we can't get a few more ashley's in the lead two to one so gotta get my act together here i don't think that one's gonna be the ticket though you don't think the little white swim bait's gonna be good no i'm saying I think oh that's, you think that's gonna be the that's ticket money. there's only yeah. one of those i got the only one and it's missing an eye it came I that way injured injured better yeah injured uh bait fish that's what they're going for anyways but we got a little drain right up here let's see if we can't pick a few off of it 
All right, you ready to go to the creek? Get some shade, meet some mosquitoes. Oh, oh, he's got it, he's got it, he's got it. Got him, finally. Oh, it was just a bass swimming by. No, all right, whatever. Still two to two, or no, now it's two to two. Look, I caught him on, yeah, that counts. I caught him under his lip, that was weird. I got him up in the air. It, it's not it a perfect, not a perfect catch, but we'll take it. Got one, got one, got one. Nice. This sadly might be our biggest one of the day so far. All right, this is uh, sadly the biggest one of the day so far. Oh, he's, he's biting me, did you see that? Yeah, I saw that. Bite you back. That was weird. That was weird, don't do that again. Let's edit that. Look at that. Oh yeah, he's biting me again. Yeah. Let's get a little release on this beautiful fella. All right, score update. John has just surpassed me. We're three to two now, but yeah. we're coming up to the creek. And I think with both of our really small baits, I think your curly tail is going to crush it in the yeah. creek, so. It's got lots of good action. Yeah. You're so. definitely going to get the bluegill. I don't know what's going to bite mine, but uh, there's some big bass in that creek, so maybe we'll get a uh, giant bass on a tiny swim bait. <laughs> or maybe you'll finally catch a bluegill out of this creek. Finally. We haven't caught a bluegill all day. We came no. out here. We've been out here for like an hour, <laughs> hour and a half. It's all we wanted to do. It's all we wanted to do, and they're not complying, so. <sighs> we'll keep trying. We'll keep trying for you guys. Nothing's biting this little crawdad. Maybe a gar will. Oh. Close my bail. Got him. Got him. Bluegill! Finally! A bluegill! Uh, I win! I win! Finally! Nice! Little pecker heads. Literally, all they do is peck, and they got tiny heads, so therefore, they are affectionately known in our household as pecker heads. This is what we've been after the entire time. See, look at that tiny little mouth. That's yep. why they're so, so annoying. Pretty so frustrating. One. Pretty big one to be able to lip it, but let's get this guy back in there. Finally got a bluegill. I'm proud of you. Mm -hmm. Oh yeah. 10 on the dismount. <laughs> How many times we fished that creek when you finally caught a bluegill out of finally. it? Finally. Can uh, die a happy man. <laughs> now catch another one. Got something. Oh, you got one? A bass. <laughs> nice. <laughs> All right, Ashley's catching up. It's almost dark out. Got a small guy. <laughs> yeah. It's a little guy. Might be the uh, biggest one of the day, sadly, though. Uh, yeah, it's close. But we were going for small fish, so check. Check. <laughs> got that accomplished. All right, I think it should be okay, really. Yep. You saying the nosedive is where to go? Yeah, nosedive. Oh, the GoPro just died. All right. There we go. Perfect. <laughs> And you have to, <laughs> yeah, when you have to release them like on a ledge or something like that, it's good to get them to like dive straight back in. When they hit their face, it kind of like shocks them back into a, uh, yeah. yeah. And you just can never see it on camera. This is literally like an eight foot drop off. There's no way to do yeah. that nicely. If you, if you manage to get down there, you're not going to manage to get back up. No. <laughs> but I got three. All right. I don't know if I mentioned it, but as soon as I got to the creek, the blue grub, you couldn't see it all. So I switched over to the chartreuse one and it definitely helped. You could see it through the water and the fish could definitely see it. Got hit by, a, it feels like 50 bluegill, but I finally got a bass. So, but it was a small bass and we're definitely going for small fish today. And that was very small. What do you say that was like a quarter pound? Yeah, <laughs> that's why we're going with a quarter pound. So. I mean, we originally came after bluegill, so. Yeah, I mean, you, have officially won the challenge because you caught it's not a over though. yet the gopros are both dead so whatever you're gonna see is on the phone yeah so i'm not sure how good it's going to be but nope but gonna... one of us caught a bluegill and some bass so still a good day Yo, oh where'd you go yes <laughs> tiny little bluegill <laughs> now you got two bluegill <laughs> oh, look at that <laughs> nice caught him on the uh tiny little crawl that i broke one of them off but i switched to this is like a black and red flake one you seem to like it Get him back in there. Cool. 9.10. 9.10? 9.10 would be a 10. Uh, yeah. Hmm. So 10. 
<laughs> yeah, no matter how you get it. Casting blindly. Into trees. While being tickled by mosquitoes. Oh, I got one. Got one. <laughs> you see me? Oh, this is the biggest one of the day, yeah. easily. This is what we're talking about, guys. Big Florida blue, well, somewhat big. Biggest. They look big in the dark. Don't spike me, dude. There we go. Biggest bluegill of the day, I think. Nice. You guys may be wondering why we're uh, after these tiny little fish when there's giant. Ashley's caught a 10 pound bass out of here, but brings us back to uh, the good old uh, Midwestern Creek fishing that we enjoy so much. So Let's see if we can see. Well, we heard it if nothing else. <laughs> Really got one? Yep, got one. Come on, buddy. Yeah! <laughs> oh yeah, boy. Oh, oh my gosh. Tank! Tank! <laughs> Stayed out here all day, finally caught a tank bluegill. That's what I'm talking about. Oh man. Yeah, give me two seconds. I'm gonna turn the flashback on. Alright, there we go guys. All right, turn panfish. I'm not sure if this is a warm out there or a bluegill. It's too dark out here to tell. Yeah, I just tried to, had to turn the flash back yeah. on. Our hard work has persevered. I think we've caught like 10 fish now. That thing is huge. Yeah, that thing is as big as my hand right there. That's crazy. Finally. That's bigger than any of the bass we've oh, caught Oh yeah, today. that thing is huge. Easily. Woo. That's, That's why I admire it a little bit more. All right, dude, thank you. <laughs> Good job. Right in that drain. We have. No. Oh, he came off. He's right there. Oh, oh my god, that water is so warm. That's so gross. That is the first time ever you've caught one out of that drain. Oh, you like caught it right on the fall too. Whew. Next time we know, come here at dusk. Yeah. With some uh, industrial strength, uh, what is this stuff called? Bug spray? Yes. Let's see if there's another one under there. Come on! Oh my goodness, if this is a bluegill. Oh! No! Giant! <laughs> giant bluegill! We are on them now! Oh my goodness, look at this, guys! That's crazy! Hopefully, you guys have made it to the end of this video. If you have, we're gonna do a giveaway. We're gonna figure out some uh, good. Uh, bluegill lures and we'll send them out to you. All you guys have to do is uh, hit the like button on this video, be a subscriber, and comment peckerhead. Oh jeez. No, don't comment peckerhead. <laughs> comment uh... I love bluegill. I love bluegill. Or tiny fish rule. Anything you want will enter you into the old contest. Uh, as long as it's contest. appropriate, you're good. Yeah, as long as it's appropriate. If you do comment peckerhead, you get two entries. But check this out. This is definitely a bluegill. I think that last one was a warm mouth looking back on it, but absolute tank of a bluegill. Let me get a side view. Yeah, this Got is me. what we came here for. <laughs> Look at him. Get a size to my hand. Awesome. Uh, Almost looks like a uh, crappie. It's like a yeah, crappie and a bluegill mi mix right there. That is awesome. So excited. We spent, we've been out here for probably about two and a half, three hours. Finally catching them at the end. See if you can't get one more. Cool. Oh yeah, give me boxers. <laughs> These things are hard to release. There we go. All right guys, there you have it. Hopefully you enjoyed today's video. We forgot to film an outro yesterday. We were getting eaten alive yes. by mosquitoes. <laughs> that was terrifying. One got me on my lip and my cheek was swollen. Yeah. It was quite terrifying. It looked like uh, Mike Tyson punched her or something like that. Good <laughs> thing we didn't bad. get stopped by the cops on the way home or that would have been a uh, that would have been a weird uh, story. What were you doing to your wife? Uh, we were just going fishing. but yeah, uh, Just catching giant monster bluegill. No yeah, <laughs> that was the point of the video. And we finally got around to it at the end. So hopefully you guys made it this far. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe and uh, enter that giveaway. We gave the confusing details earlier, but basically 
Comment like the video. Something yeah, positive. like the <laughs> like the video, subscribe, and then leave a comment below, and we'll uh, send you out some uh, bluegill fishing uh, lures. Uh, I think we found a couple that were good. The uh, little crawdad was uh, a winner. Yes. And the uh, tiny white swim bait. Before I broke it off, I don't know if we showed that in the video, but I broke it off on a gar. So uh, those gars are just, uh, they're messing with us. Yeah. We'll catch them one day, but hopefully you guys like this video. If you did, hit that like button and subscribe. And we'll see you next time. See you next time, guys.